but my understanding is that Krishna is there for everyone and everyone is welcome in this temple. No way. I heard Krishna had an Indian passport. <laughs> Isn't that true? Um, Tell me that's not true. I don't think Krishna has an Indian passport. You see, just like how the sun shines everywhere, and in different parts of the world, the sun has different names. So in England, we say sun. Anyone speak a different language here in the audience? Yeah? Suraj? Sur and what language is that? Gujarati. See, in Gujarat, they say Suraj. So we can see that Brian, the sun has many different names. And just because the sun shines in England, doesn't mean it's an English sun. <laughs> so really, Krishna is a name for God. And yes, he was born in India, but he's there for everyone. Okay. Oh, well, that makes sense. I still think Krishna had an Indian passport. Otherwise, he would be in England. <laughs> okay. And it's... it's yeah, it's difficult to get a British passport anyway, isn't it? <laughs> Ask all these guys, that's why they're here. But, yeah, anyway. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay, great. So, second question is, um, can I have your phone number? Uh, no, Brian, I'm, a, I'm married. I'm sorry, I can't sorry, give sorry. you my phone. Can we go for dinner sometime? For dinner? Yeah. Well, um, why don't we go to McDonald's just outside? I know a lot of people from here go there. First come to the temple, straight to McDonald's for a good old burger. <laughs> I don't think that's true, Brian. And to be honest, I don't eat meat. You don't? Why? No. Well, you see, Krishna teaches us in the Bhagavad Gita that every living entity has a soul. So we don't want to harm these people or these animals. But they're already dead when you eat them. But that still doesn't make it okay, Brian. Um, so look, there's many vegetarian restaurants. Maybe we can go there together. But just um, as friends. Uh, yeah. Okay, just this once. Okay. okay. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, so do you think I have a soul? Brian, I do think you have a soul. That's how you're alive. Oh yeah, it's this dead guy's soul I got, isn't it? That's true. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay, so what happens to the soul when the body dies? Ooh, that's a... That's a tricky question. So uh -huh. what happens to the soul, Brian, when the soul, the soul actually never dies? Really? Yeah, the soul never dies and the soul is the essence of who you really are. That never dies, but when the body dies, the soul moves on to another body. No way. Okay, so what is the next body for a puppet? For a puppet? Yeah. Well, Brian, it really depends on are you talking about yourself or yeah. puppets in general? I mean, how many puppets do you know that can talk? Not that many. <laughs> so, Brian, it really depends on your actions. It depends on what you do in this life. And also, it depends on what you desire. Ooh. So, if I really like to be a dog, can I be a dog? Sure. What about a pig? Sure. Elephant? Yeah. Horse? Yeah. Wow, this is so cool. But would I be a normal horse or a puppet horse? Well, it really depends, Brian. It's not up to me, really. Okay. Listen, so, Brian, you can be whatever you want to be. Really? Yes. Can I be God? Can you be God? Yeah. See, Brian, you can't be God. Why not? Well, there's only one God, but you are part. You are a part and parcel of God. Just really? like how the ocean is so vast, the uh -huh. ocean is wet and salty, uh -huh. and when you take a drop of that ocean, uh -huh. it has the same qualities as in it's salty and wet, uh -huh. but it's not the same as the ocean, which is so, so vast. So just like that, Brian, you're a part and parcel of God, but you are never going to be Him. But what if, I, what, if, what if I take a lot of drugs and become spiritual, then can I be God? Unfortunately, Brian, drugs don't really make you spiritual. Really? But I've seen you guys meditating. How can you meditate for so long if you're not on drugs? Well, Brian, what we do is we chant the Maha Mantra. Yeah. Do you know what that is, Brian? No idea. Should we help him out? Okay, everyone, in the crowd, can you please tell Brian what the Maha Mantra is? What's the Maha Mantra? I can't hear you. I can't hear you. I can't hear you, Stan.
something wrong. Anyway, so. And that's the Maha Mantra. Oh, okay. And people here at the temple, they chant this mantra for as long, long time until they get the Buddha and it helps them find inner peace and happiness. No way. Yeah. Inner peace. Yeah. Is there peace inside me? I think so, deep down. I think right now the only thing that's inside of me is a hand. <laughs> Do you think I can find inner peace? I think so, Brian. I think anyone can find inner peace. But I like to earn money and I like pretty women and I like a big house. Can I still find peace? That's fine. You can still like pretty women make lots of money, have a big house, but it's still possible to find peace, Brian. It all depends on your consciousness. Really? In fact, Brian, the School of Bhakti do many different courses which can teach you how to achieve this. The School of Bhakti? Yeah. Do I have to pay? Um, some courses are free. Well, I'll take the free ones. I'm sure. not rich yet, but I understand that I can be rich very soon. I'm the only talk talking puppet I know. So anyone would employ a talking puppet and then I can do a paid course. Can I do a free course? Yes, Brian, you can. Cool, 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 cool. And you can even get a discount. No way! Yeah, at the school of about 10 right there at the Whoa. back, they're giving out big discounts. No way! Big yes. discount! Yes. So cool! Okay, so what do I do? How do I do a course? Well, you have to go online and sign up. Can I sign up here? You can. How? You go over to the tent at the back, the Jumanji School of Bhakti tent, and you can sign up. I heard they do a course called the Get a Life course. No, Brian, it's not the Get a Life course, okay. it's the Gita Life course. Oh dear, oh, oh okay, okay, cool, 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 cool. Okay, the Gita Life course. Okay, I might sign up to that one. Yeah. Okay, uh, but can we go for dinner sometime? <laughs> yes, Brian, we can go for dinner as long as it's a vegetarian restaurant. Is that okay? Are there any good ones here? I think so. Anyone know any good vegetarian restaurants? Om Nom. Om Nom. Govinda. Sounds like Nom 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 Nom. <laughs> Mood Cafe. Mood Cafe. That sounds wrong. It just sounds like a cafe. No, I've been there before. Moody. It's actually very nice, Brian. It's a it's a good one, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We can go to Mood Cafe then. Brian, do you have any other questions, any other burning questions for me today? I can't have burning questions, I'll just burn into ashes, I'm a puppet. I just have normal questions, but I think I'm done now. You're done I'm now? I'm getting tired. Okay. Yeah. Okay, well Brian, how, what are we going to do with you now? Huh? What are we going to do with you now? I don't know. What do you want to do? <laughs> I, I think know. I can go to sleep. You want to go to sleep? Yeah, I'm tired. Okay, what, what's the best way to get you to go to sleep, Brian? Can you sing me a lullaby? Okay. Anyone know any lullabies? Any good lullabies? Or how about the Maha Mantra, Brian? Did you like that one? Um, well, yeah, okay, go ahead. <laughs> okay, and do you want me to do it or do you want the audience to help? Everybody! Okay, on the count of three, if we could all sing or chant yeah. the Maha Mantra to get Brian to sleep. Yeah. Ready? I want to One, sleep. two, three. Krishna, 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 Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Hare his show. Sometimes he gets good feedback, sometimes he gets bad feedback. But what about the guy underneath the cloth? How are we going to bring him back to life? Or maybe we should just leave him like that. I think my life would be a lot more peaceful if I left him like that. Okay, so I'm, maybe I can just leave the stage and leave him. What do you think? Huh? Stop, Brian. Mm. Non-violence here. <laughs> Ask Brian to do Brian's already asleep. Do you know what? I think the only thing to do is for you all to chant the Hare Krishna mantra again. And then hopefully Radha's soul can come back into the body. Are you ready? Okay, and go!
Why is there a puppet in my hand? It's a long story. Oh dear. Okay. Oh well. Thank you for joining us today. I have no idea what just happened in the last 20 minutes. Hopefully. Was, was he talking again? He was. Was he okay? He was okay. Did he swear this time? He didn't swear. He didn't swear. Okay. We got that under control. Thank you all so much. If you are free, if you do have time, go over to the School of Bhakti tent over there. It's called the Jumanji tent. And you can go over there, play a Jumanji game. And you can also do the free Gita Life Taster session. Okay, we're doing a free Gita Life Taster, a full day, where you can learn the Bhagavad Gita. It's completely free. You can sign up for that at the School of Bhakti Tent that you can do anytime. Okay, thank you all very much for joining us today. Hope you enjoyed the show. If you didn't, um, what to do? It's done now. You lost those 20 minutes of your life. You're never going to get them back. But see you all later. Hare Krishna. Take care. Hare Krishna.